everywhere for all the countries that are growing rice traditional uh, are in are going to face a crisis after the introduction of any gm rice because that might uh, eliminate i mean erode the genetic diversity of rice in the first place secondly uh, the genetic contamination uh, through cross pollination from the gm rice to all other crops to rice is a major setback for the entire ecosystem because we don't know what are the unsat what are the uh, unpredictable effects would be on the entire rice ecosystems and the food webs the, the third is that uh, once it is uh, given to the farmers by the corporate sectors that will be a complete control of the food security of the nation and that will also destroy and disintegrate the rights and sovereignty of the farmers over their own seeds uh, as a scientist i am trying to collate all the evidence uh, scientific evidence of the uh, inherent uncertainties of gm crops gm rice on the molecular level ecosystems level and the organismal level so that we can uh, argue with the uh, scientists promoting this gm gm crops and try to conscientize them uh, not to promote this uh, as the magic bullet solution to food security as a farmer activist i would also convince the farmers themselves to reject this uh, any kinds of techno fix solutions uh, and to reject any kinds of you know, corporate sector uh, corporate supplied seeds uh, because they have to defend their own uh, sovereignty over seeds and as a conservator i will try to i am trying to convince the farmers to protect their own genetic diversity of seeds in their own hands not to lose them because they are the our best bet of food security